Welcome back to day four of the 2019 Twin Cities Film Fest. Here on the Ballard Spa red carpet, I am Miss Shannon, and we're moving into our final film of the evening, and a little different than the last one we talked about. Now we are here joined with everyone from the field. We have our director, Tate Bunker, and our actors, Tim Higgins and Kara Mulrooney. Thank you guys for joining us. So I will let you explain the field because I feel like we have a number of films that have Midwestern ties and the field is one of those, but we should give a little taste test for everybody that couldn't make tonight of what the field is about. Uh, just real quick, it's a paranormal love story or kind of paranormal green acres. Okay. So, uh, you know, <laughs> a, a couple to save their marriage uh, sells everything in Chicago, buys a, a f organic farm in, in uh, Manitowoc, Wisconsin, and and our, our main character here uh, starts finding kind of eerie things with his camera, and that begins the story. And I have been to Manitowoc, and I was very fascinated with the film because I feel like a lot of the films that are made in the Midwest, we want people to want to come to the Midwest. <laughs> I am not sure that the film is going to help people want to come here. It's a little, things go a little bit awry. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know what? Uh, farms are creepy, period. <laughs> if you, but it's like if you really want to get into farming, you got to put up with it. And so it's like, I think, I think this is a great gateway into farming. Okay. Well, when we're talking about your characters and how they are trying to actually reconnect and maybe things don't quite work out, how did you feel playing those characters in the field? Um, it was, it was honestly a ton of fun. Um, Tate actually I just Tim and I just met shortly before filming um, but we had to be this couple that had been together for years to the point that they had marital stress and problems and almost broke up so Tate had to start out by dating we would go we would go on dates we did a photo booth um, uh, so uh, so that was a ton of fun but yeah I guess the acting came in when we had to act as though it was not enjoyable or <laughs> And you had some other, like some of our other, like bigger stars that are not Midwestern based, who are in there as well. Like I saw my friend Barry Bowswick in the film yep. as well. Uh, what was it like working with him? Oh well, there's also Veronica Cartwright, who was in The Birds and the original Alien, um, and Mark Metcalf from Animal House, and it was wonderful working with them. And so they, there's a part in the story where all the elders of the town kind of know all these deep secrets. So I thought, oh, I could maybe get some of these bigger names to kind of play those elders, and and uh, uh, but it was it was a wonderful joy. So, what was your favorite thing about creating the the field? Um, I'd have to say, um, I, I think it was production because production it was it was crazy up to production, but production production just went incredibly smooth. It was just everyone was fast, everyone was on on their game, and it just went really well. And so that that I think is the most remarkable thing is a smooth production. And Tim and Kara, did you learn anything uh, from your on screen relationship that helped you in your real life? Uh, sure. Maybe <laughs> just like, you know, give people space okay. when they need it, okay. but then like ask questions. Okay. Just like learn to be like, is something going on? And like, if they're like, no, oh, no. And it's like, no, no, no. Is there? Because <laughs> right. usually there is. Mm -hmm. And then uh, that just helps out. Yeah. Yeah. Needle just talk to each just, other. Just, like, just talk to what's each wrong? other. And and you had asked about Barry Bostwick. He's a delight. delight. He's so funny. Wonder, who did we find? So this, is, oh. this is Daniel Lindsay. So he, he worked on the film as well. So all Hi, Daniel. Welcome. Spooky. Welcome. Scooch on in. Digital, digital prop. Yeah. He did digital props, which is very important to this. Which I mean, all of these things. We have a number of those. We we do love our spooky style films here in the Midwest. So you help make everything look amazing. <laughs> Is that was that one of the creepy faces you got to make in the field? Oh, uh, just wait. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're gonna uh, make sure that everybody can find the field out in the wild. But let's start with I want all of our actors to let everybody tell uh, to tell everybody where they can find you on the socials. So should we start with you? Oh, sure thing. Yes. yes. Okay. Uh, well, the the field is at the field the film, and I am Kara Mulrooney. So at Kara Mulrooney, K A R A. Uh, let's go to our lurker right here. So our <laughs> I'm Tim Higgins, and look Higgins for Tim Higgins or Tiggins808 on Instagram. <laughs> and Tate, we did give out the, the website to the field, but what are your next plans for it other than the Twin Cities Film Fest? Well, the film is, is already had its digital release, so you can find it on many, many platforms, but the e easiest two is uh, Amazon and iTunes. You can find it if you can't make it today's screen screening. <laughs> 
So. Well, I can feel the love in this field. Even though the field is a little bit creepy, everybody's going to love it. So make sure you check it out. And we really appreciate you sharing your film with us here at the Twin Cities Film Thanks Fest. Thanks for, for allowing us this opportunity to show it. Our favor, our pleasure, our pleasure. And we thanks everybody who's joined us for day four of the Twin Cities Film Fest. who we'll see you back here again on the Ballast Bar red carpet.